Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome to Cosmic Culture, the channel where we talk about all major movie and television news. It's Chris, and the last few days have been a bit of a wild ride for Fantastic Beasts 3. Now, if you haven't heard already, a few days ago, Johnny Depp was forced to step down from his role of Grindelwald in the Fantastic Beast movies. And if you've seen the first and second one, you'll realize he's pretty central to the future of this franchise and where it is heading. So this causes a lot of different changes. The reason Johnny Depp had to step down has to do with a lot of personal legal stuff between him and Amber Heard. I'm not going to get into all of that because that would take an hour to explain even the beginning of it. And it is very complicated and unfortunate for all parties involved. Regardless of that matter, Warner Brothers asked Johnny Depp to step down and he came out on Instagram with this statement. Firstly, I'd like to thank everyone who has gifted us with their support and loyalty. I have been humbled and moved by your many messages of love and concern, particularly over the last few days. Secondly, I wish to let you know that I have been asked to resign by Warner Bros from my role as Grindelwald in the Fantastic Beasts and I have respected and agreed to their request. The surreal judgment of the court in the UK will not change my fight to tell the truth and I confirmed that plan to appeal. My resolve remains strong and I intend to prove that all the allegations against me are false. My life and career will not be defined by this moment in time. So yes, some crazy news for Johnny Depp and all parties involved in this trial case and this court case, including Warner Brothers who have now asked Johnny Depp to step down from the role. But this will frantically change what the plans were for Fantastic Beast, which have promised us five movies and left us on a gigantic cliffhanger with Grindelwald's character and the future of this franchise for the entire Harry Potter universe. And of course, there are repercussions to asking Johnny Depp to step down. Before we go further, if you'd love to stay up to date on all this major movie and television news as much as we do, be sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you don't miss any crazy news in real time. So just to cut to it, let's talk about the consequences of losing Johnny Depp as Grindelwald in these movies and what it will mean. First and foremost, we are going to be seeing a delay, and this delay will not be due to COVID-19, which is a surprise since every movie for the last year has been delayed due to COVID-19. But in fact, they're going to have to pick up the pieces from what is now probably a fallen apart plot point, losing what was their main antagonist, main character of the story, as far as the direction of the plot and where it was really headed, had to go. So the already delayed movie, which was pushed back until November 12th, 2021, due to coronavirus, is now being pushed back reportedly to July 15th of 2022. And this is exclusively because of the loss of Johnny Depp's character. Now, we don't know what their plan is moving forward, and honestly, they probably don't just yet either. Whether they're going to just replace the actor, or try to make a similarity out of the character with computer and movie magic, or if they're going to just try to get rid of the character completely. We've had similar situations with this happen before where actors passed away, and there seems to be a kind of agreement among all fans and creators of movies that... Virtually recreating that character is kind of inappropriate, but this is a little bit different in the sense that Johnny Depp isn't dead, he's just been removed from the project. Now, although I realize this is a sensitive topic for Johnny Depp, a sensitive situation, and Warner Brothers is trying to handle it the best they can, it does seem a little bit crazy that one of the main characters is now gone from the movie completely, and that they're either going to have to replace the actor, who is an extremely well-known and loved actor, who is extremely well-liked in this role of Grindelwald, or they're going to have to move in a different direction and somehow get rid of Grindelwald, whether they kill him off or he dies really on in the next movie or however they plan on doing it. It has all been set up around Grindelwald, Dumbledore, and the rest of the new cast in their story related to that. So it is going to be a little bit of a struggle for them to get back on track. However, people have done it before and it isn't that big of a deal. We're just going to have to hopefully get a storyline that we can like as much as what we have been enjoying from Fantastic Beasts. And on top of that, Another nearly year-long delay, pushing this movie back again while they try to pick up the pieces from the fallen plot, which is falling apart as Johnny Depp steps away. Now, whether or not it is the right decision to ask Johnny Depp to step away, it is really irrelevant because it is done now and Johnny Depp has left. He's also lost different movie opportunities like Pirates of the Caribbean, which movie was scrapped in the middle of all of this trial and many other movie opportunities that I'm sure would have come Mr. Depp's way. But don't feel too, too terribly, because it seems like Warner Brothers is still on the hook to pay Johnny Depp for his role in Fantastic Beasts, even though he will not be appearing in the movie. So he's going to be making eight figures on a movie he's not even going to show up in. 
which of course will also potentially affect the budget moving forward. But this is a huge blockbuster movie with the potential and the belief that it will be bringing in a lot of money, so that isn't really really that big of a deal or concern. But this is the news so far, Fantastic Beasts pushed back until July 15th, 2022. Johnny Depp's Grindelwald has been asked to be removed and stepped down from the role, and we're going to be picking up the pieces, so any news that will be coming out about Fantastic Beasts in the coming weeks, we'll be sure to let you know here on the channel. I know a lot of people are wondering what the future will hold and what the plans are moving forward, but I'm sure Warner Brothers has some form of a plan, and it will be made light to us as soon as it is figured out. Let me know what you guys think about this news in the comments down below. Yes, it is a little bit sad. Some of you think it might be appropriate. It really kind of depends on perspective and view of this trial and how everything is headed. But let me know what your guys' opinion is. As always, thank you to everybody who watched till the very end of the video. If you found it helpful, useful, or entertaining, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button as we're covering all major movie and television news right here on Cosmic Culture.